Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to modify one of these uh, 5 inch black and white TV sets. Um, all you need is a screwdriver, a pair of snips, solder nine and solder, and some wire, and obviously something as well to uh, test it. I'm going to use this retro TV games thing, which I got for Christmas last year. So... So, once you've got it open, um, I'm not really going to go into how to take these things apart because you can probably work it out yourself and it does vary depending on the uh, the model and the design and all that. Um, but yeah, what we're looking for really is, let's uh, go in here, if we have a look at this circuit board, you'll notice there's this rather large uh, chip here. Um, hang on, let's just see if I can do this one handed. Yeah. Here we have the CD5151CP chip. So let's see if I can zoom it in. Uh, my camera. Yeah, that's just. Yeah. So, yeah. So, what we're going to have to do is this pin 5, which I'll, I can show you, is uh, here. You'll see there's a little link here. And that is the composite video input. So um, at the moment, this is hardwired to um, the RF receiver, but uh, obviously they switched that off in the UK, certainly in the Northeast, uh, they switched that off in uh, 2012, so there's no point us using that. So what we need to do is snip this and tap into it. Right, I thought I'd power the TV up because, you know, frankly, <laughs> if it's worth doing, it's worth doing dangerously. Um, yeah, this is... Um, you know, this is still uh, still a few thousand volts going to that. Not as much as a large um, color TV, but still enough to give you a bit of a a bit of a nasty belt. But uh, you know, so so let's get go to this. I thought I'd do this sort of as it's powered up, just to really show you what happens when you snip the wire. So um, so this is it being snipped. No, it's not. Hang on. God, this is incredibly difficult to do one hand. Just hang on. Okay, yeah, man. I may just unsolder that actually. Come <laughs> yeah, on. There we go. <laughs> that took some doing. But there you go. Now you can see the snow has gone. And now we just uh now we just have nothing. As the input now so right right so you should be able to see that um, I've tapped in here so this this pink wire is the one that I've added now I need to point out here that I haven't actually connected this to the chip this was the wire that was going to, to pin 5 um, but now it's uh, I've just tapped in straight to that wire so um, yeah, and I always say tap into uh, pin five, but no, this is it's this the, the wire before it goes to pin five is what you need to tap into. Um, now for a, for a ground connection, all I've done is take the battery connector because I'm not really going to be using batteries in this thing anywhere. Because I mean, look how many it takes for God's sake. <laughs> I don't think there's that many C cells in in this town, frankly. But yeah, so yeah. So I'm just going to use that, and I've just soldered this roughly to the uh, the video output uh, thing on this uh, Retro Games module. So let's uh, connect it up. Oh, well, it's already connected up. Let's switch it on and uh, see what we've got. And there we go. That actually looks slightly better in real life than it does on the camera. Hang on, let's, let's just see if I can make this look a bit... Better hang on for the camera. There we go. All right. So yeah. So there you can see it's uh, working very nicely. Um. Now, what the hell is police dog lazy? <laughs> is that supposed to be Lassie or police dog lazy? What? Police versus thief. Pong pong power robots. What the bloody hell? All right. I'm gonna. I'm. I'm gonna have to. Police dog lazy. Let's start that one. What? <laughs> My God, that's hilarious! <laughs> what the hell? What? What? 
What? Am I supposed to be doing something here? What? What's he doing? What? 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 Look, I'm, I'm not actually controlling this, by the way. Oh, right, okay. Has the dog got to come over and... S what? All right. Okay, I'm presuming the dog's got to go and sniff. All oh, right, okay, so you've got to dig up things. What a bizarre... Oh, there we go. So I found... What? What a bizarre game. Hmm. <laughs> oh, man, I've just... <laughs> And I've got, we've got some hilarious ones here. I've got Man in Red. Man in Red is dancing with me. Uh, we've got Mirror Devilwood, Mouse Snare. Mm. I'm presuming that's something to do with the Muppets. I don't know. Happy Match. Yeah, they're just, wow, Little Witch. Hammer and Nail. That sounds fun, doesn't it? Let's see what... <laughs> Yeah, I think, um, I don't know if these are actually original games, because uh, obviously there's the issue with um, copyright, and because uh, normally, because this is obviously a knockoff uh, NES on a chip, but, uh, oh, is it, um, is it whack -a -mole? I wonder, yes. Sorry, I, this is totally irrelevant to the video. Yeah. Now, you'll, uh, one thing I, I need to mention, of course, is sound. Now, because this was a stupidly short lead and it uh, wasn't even plug, it wasn't even on a plug, it was just soldered directly to the board. Love that. And, you know, hot glued and, yeah, you know, quality. <laughs> uh, I had to, had to cut the wire. Um, but usually it's just a case of finding, because this one's also got a radio built in, you can normally just tap in uh, using these four wires, um, just finding which one's the, the radio. It's usually the uh, the green or the yellow wire. Um, but what I would say is rather than do that, um, I would just get a PAM8403 or PAM8403 uh, on a chip audio thing with the built-in volume control because this is far better than uh, the sound circuit on this because I remember this was particularly terrible. You couldn't turn it up much before it would distort like hell. Um, and I mean, the speaker isn't great, but, you know, frankly, <laughs> it wasn't up to anything. So, yeah, so that's the thing. So it's a PAM or PAM 8403. Um there's the you can get these on eBay, AliExpress, you know, wherever. Probably wish.com as well. Although God knows what they'll send you then. Probably probably just a drawing of one on a bit of paper. But yeah, they're these are I think I, I got this for about you know, I've got a pack of five for like a pound. So yeah. But there you go. Just to prove this does definitely does work.